Um, so this is a snippet of Obama's recent portrait. And clearly there's a giant sperm on his forehead made to look like a vein. It's hidden. And the artist is known for doing this. Uh, do you think for one second that the White House, the president, or even an ex-president with staff would just willy-nilly hire any artist without looking into the artist's previous work, potential hazards, uh, potential threats, potential controversy? And uh, honestly, do you really think they would just willy-nilly hire anybody? This tweet by One Filter Air. Obama embarrassed by artist who draws sperm on each of his paintings? Really? You think he's embarrassed? Do you think he's embarrassed? Do you think that's an accident? you think they didn't bother vetting that artist? Get out of here. So I, here's a picture of Kevin Hart by the same artist. And what's in the background? It's loaded with sperm. I mean, this guy's known for doing this. Again, um, this artist, I don't know who that is, but the artist is known for putting images come on focus right there on the zip. He made the zipper look like, there we go. <laughs> So this picture here of this guy, again, I don't know who, painted to look like Napoleon, like that. Here's a close-up of the guy's shoe under the horse. The guy likes to put sperm in his pictures. Um, that looks like the corner of a frame. I mean, the guy's got a serious fetish with sperm. It's no secret. So here's Obama's actual forehead temple, and that's how he was portrayed. So, uh, what did you expect, Obama? This, this ectoplasm! Did you see the ghost? It ran through here, it, it slimed! He slimed me. Papa, are you okay? He slimed me. I feel so funky. Spangler, I'm with Bankman. Oh. He got slimed! That's great, Ray. Save some for me. 